Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Timmy Treacle, and this video is going to be an update video on the Conjuring universe or franchise of movies. For those of you who don't know, we are getting a third Conjuring movie that comes out this year. Um, it is Conjuring 3, The Devil Made Me Do It. Um, it's a long time coming. Um, I can't believe that The Conjuring um, has taken this long to get a third movie out, considering um, it was the first movie to be released in the franchise. But um, besides that movie, I have other uh, information about some more movies coming uh, to this universe. And if you're a fan like me, you're going to be really excited. If you're not a big fan of this franchise, um, you probably don't want to hear this. But um, as of right now, um, there are uh, works for another Annabelle movie. We're going to be getting a... Uh, sequel to The Nun, and we are going to be getting another spinoff called The Crooked Man. Uh, now, uh, we got a spinoff called The Curse of La Llorona uh, earlier this uh, last year, I should say. I keep saying this year, it was actually last year, but right now, as it stands, there are seven movies that are out. Like I said, Conjuring 3 is going to be coming out. Uh, the timeline for these movies is great. Uh, there's all the information you need to know about this franchise. Uh, all you got to do is Google it. But um, as far as movies that are going to be coming out, uh, we know, like I said, I know of Conjuring 3 for sure. The other movies I uh, mentioned don't yet have release dates, but uh, from what I know, they are coming. Um, they're in just early stages, uh, pre-production, uh, getting the script together and all these fun things. But we are going to get these movies. As long as these movies keep making money and the stories are interesting, they're going to be made. And they're going to make a lot more. So, um, uh, like I said, we're going to get a fourth Annabelle movie, a second Nun movie, and then, of course, we're getting The Conjuring 3. And then another spinoff, The Crooked Man. It's all going to be in the same um, universe and timeline. Um, just don't have no affiliation uh, pretty much with uh, all the movies. Just a couple. But uh, the timeline, if you're interested uh, with the franchise, um, The Nun is first in the timeline. It takes place in 1952. Uh, Annabelle Creation is next in 1955. The uh, first Annabelle movie is 1967. Uh, the Conjuring is 1971. Annabelle Comes Home is 1972. The Curse of La Llorona is 1973. And The Conjuring 2 is 1977. With this third Conjuring movie, it will be taking place in 1981. So... Uh, the timeline is sweet. Uh, I, I love these movies. And I probably, as soon as I get my hands on all the movies, I'm going to watch them in the order of the timeline just to see, you know, what the big deal is. But I'm a huge fan, like I said, of these movies. Uh, I enjoy The Curse of Leatherona. I know a lot of people had it on their list of the worst of the year. That's fine. Uh, Linda Cardellini, I love as the lead actress in this movie. And I had fun with it. I love the supernatural um, uh, part of horror. And this is no different. Uh, I was a huge fan of The Nun. I love that movie as well. And I cannot wait to see The Conjuring 3. The Conjuring by far is my favorite um, as far as... Uh, but the trilogy or my favorite trilogy or um, part of the franchise goes is The Conjuring. Uh, but I love all the movies. I don't hate any of them. And like I said, I'm really excited for this franchise going forward. It's one of my favorites out there. Um, to give you a glimpse of how popular these movies are, 
as far as box office wise, um, the first seven films had a total budget of 139.5 million. Um, and then in America alone, those seven movies made 672.5 million at the box office. Add in um, foreign dollars, um, they made another 1,247.1 million. Combine that together worldwide, they made 1,919.6 million at the box office. Uh, and as I said, they're going to continue to make these movies. Not only because they're making money, but the stories are good, and there are there is a big fan base for these uh, movies, and I am one of them. I love this franchise. Um, as far as Rotten Tomatoes goes, uh, the original Conjuring has an eighty-five percent. The first Annabelle movie has a twenty-nine percent. Uh, not a lot of people like that movie. Uh, the Conjuring Two has eighty percent. Annabelle Creation has the highest of the Annabelle film so far at 70%. The Nun got a low 26%. That is the lowest of the franchise so far. Uh, the Curse of Leather Rona has a 29%. <laughs> and then, of course, Annabelle Comes Home has a 64% on Rotten Tomatoes. So overall, this franchise is um, mixed when it comes to Rotten Tomatoes. But for me, I love all the movies. Uh, they're not all perfect, but my favorite one out of all the movies so far is The Conjuring 2. Uh, but other than that, that is my update for the uh, Conjuring franchise or universe, if you will. And as I said, we're, we already got a Conjuring 3 coming out this year. Um, and from my sources, we're getting another Annabelle movie another nun movie and then the crooked man as kind of a spin-off type of film like the curse of leather rona but other than that that's my update for that in the comment section below if you have uh, any questions or anything leave them in the comment section below and as always if you're new to the channel subscribe today for more content if you like this video hit that like button and Give me your ranking of all seven uh, Conjuring Universe movies from your least favorite to your favorite. I would love to see your guys' list. And other than that, I thank you for watching and check you later.